In this video we are going to have the LG Old 65 Spewer review, we will have a detailed look on the various features this product possesses. This video will help you decide whether this television is perfect for your needs. We provided a link on the description to give you the best prices on the market right now. The LG BX OLED is the entry-level TV in LG's 2024K OLED lineup in the United States. It sits below the LG CX OLED and it replaces the LG B9 OLED from 2019. There aren't many OLED TVs available, but its main competitor is the Sony A8H OLED and it has a few LED competitors like the Samsung Q80T QLED. The LG BX has an outstanding style with a center-mounted stand, much like 2019's LG B9 OLED. It's also very similar to the LG CX OLED, with the only difference being that the BX's stand is smaller and it's made out of plastic. All in all, it's a great-looking modern TV. This TV has the same stand as the LG B9 OLED. It's a center-mounted plastic stand that holds the TV well, but it has more wobble than the wider, metal stand on the LG CX OLED. Footprint of the 55 inches stand, 22.1 inches by 9.1 inches. The back of the LG BX is nearly identical to the LG CX OLED and LG B9 OLED. The top half that holds the panel is metal with a smooth finish, and the bottom half where the inputs are housed is made from solid plastic. There's a clip on the back for cable management. There's a single button underneath the center of the screen. It allows you to turn the TV on slash off, change inputs, volume, and channels. HDMI ports 3 and 4 support HDMI 2.1 but not full bandwidth HDMI 2.1. The LG BX only has 40 gigabits per second ports capable of 4K at 120 Hz at 4 to 4 colon 4 10 bit instead of 48 gigabits per second ports which would be able to reach 12 bit, but we don't expect this to make any noticeable difference. The borders are thin and aren't distracting. The LG BX is very thin and it won't stick out much if wall mounted. It gets thicker with the stand attached, but it still doesn't take up a whole lot of space. The LG BX has an excellent build quality. The plastic stand isn't as sturdy as the metal stand on the LG CX OLED, but it still holds the TV well. The plastic at the bottom of the TV, near where the inputs are, flexes a bit and makes a clicking noise as if it's not connected to the panel properly, but this could be an issue with our unit only. Besides that, there aren't any obvious problems and it's a well-built TV. The LG BX comes with the same LG Magic Remote as 2019's LG B9 OLED and 2020's LG CX OLED. You can use it like a traditional remote with its navigation buttons or use it as a point and press remote, like a computer mouse. It has shortcut buttons to Netflix and Amazon Prime Video. It has built-in voice control that allows you to change inputs, search for content, or ask for the weather but some settings can't be changed through voice control. The LG BX has LG's WebOS built-in, which is easy to use and fairly smooth to navigate. We experienced one bug during testing when the peak brightness didn't work properly, even after turning the TV on and off again. However, after leaving the TV off overnight, the problem fixed itself. LG's App Store has a great selection of apps available to download and you can also cast content from your phone. The LG BX supports all common resolutions. It supports Chroma 4 to 4 colon 4, which is important for reading text if you're using it as a PC monitor, and for it to work, set the input icon to PC in the home dashboard. HDMI ports 3 and 4 are the only ones that support 4K at 120Hz, and to achieve full bandwidth, enable HDMI Ultra HD Deep Color from the settings menu. This TV supports 4K at 120Hz with proper chroma 4 to 4 colon 4, but it only works with HDMI 2.1 sources, which we can't test at the moment. We'll retest this when we have an HDMI 2.1 source. However, we were able to get it to 4K at 120Hz with chroma 4 to 2 colon 0. The LG BX is an excellent TV and like most OLED TVs, it delivers amazing overall picture quality with deep, inky blacks. It has much better out-of-the-box color accuracy than its predecessor, the LG B9 OLED, which is a nice touch if you don't want to get your TV calibrated. Sadly, the LG BX doesn't get as bright as the LG CX OLED, which could be disappointing if you want to place it in a bright room. Where to buy? You can get the LG Old 65 Spua through the link below in the description. 
we have checked to ensure those are the best price in the market right now. Thanks for watching.